Hello and welcome back to N1800. Just when I was stopping the recording of my last episode, well, Miss Hunt took again one of my islands. It's the one up here. I had no defense here, so I kind of lost it right away. It doesn't matter though, you know, so I'm just going to take it back at some point when I've got enough Man of Wars again. I do have like two waiting here now. I've got two in the new world and I've got, I think, two more in production right now. Yeah, so two more are coming, soon to be finished. And then I've got four here again. And I've also got one more here that I want to sell real quick to get some more money. More because I need that money. Very nice. So another 50k here. And what we want to do now is not the mines though. The mines are way too expensive. Just have a look at that. So it costs me like um, 5,000 per mine right now. Plus um, the maintenance cost. So I don't want to do that right now. I want to focus on getting a few more people onto my islands so in Belrock we have another marketplace here so we can of course have a few more houses like that and my next man of the line uh, ship of the line is finished so I'm going to send it to my fleet over there oh and the second one as well very nice so we got four ship of the lines again that are ready for battle and I want to have another frigate here and another clipper very nice. Okay, so I've got a few more houses here. I need to check my fish production real quick. So we do have enough fish, enough work clothes, so just that I know I can sustain so many uh, people. And I think I don't have many pups here. I have one here and one here. Okay, that is enough for now. Right, and another ceasefire with Miss Harlow. Only 300 that I need to pay because I'm so much uh, stronger than she. And that's the, the way it should be calculated in my opinion. So Miss Hunt just demands like 100,000 for a ceasefire or 45,000. And that is just not cool, you know, despite me being so much stronger than her. And Alonso, we are... Yeah, that's perfectly fine here. Ceasefire for 4,000. I don't even see how I need to, to pay that much anyway, because I'm stronger. Let's have a try at her again. 50,000. So no, just no. I'm not doing that. Oh, she's trying it again. Look at that. One of her men of wars coming closer. Okay, but other than that, looking good so far. And I do have my my lim uh, timber production here so i want to get that to another place on this island here so let's have my timber production up here plus i don't need that much timber anyway okay and now i can get rid of them here have some more buildings available some more space available for my buildings very nice and I think I need a marketplace here yeah definitely need one here let's just build happily in Belrock, because we want to have another bigger city and a marketplace once I have the wood. Ah, nope, not like that. But like that. Very nice. Look at that. Beautiful town. Getting more beautiful. And I really love that the islands now have hills and stuff like that. You know, hills, mountains on it. Makes the whole thing much more diverse. And it just looks cool to see buildings up there in the distance. Love it. Beautiful. Each town looks different. Fleet ready. And I need those man of wars here for my defense. So let's let's put it here centrally. So that should be a good spot. So whenever a ship comes by, they should be able to attack it. Or well, I should be able to see it when they want to attack. And I have my clipper here, very close to Archibald. So Archibald always sells lots of timber, very cheap. So we can do that. What else has he got? 
just some things for ships here for the town hall a bit of happiness workforce not needed right now um, but one more thing that I wanted is the bread in Bell Rock. So you can see we have schnapps now for happiness, we have sausages, we have soap. What we lack bread up to this point. So bread is something I can get from New Catan easily because we have lots of bread here and a big production as well for that. So I already have a trade route with schnapps and bread here. So it's a clipper, so we can have two more cargo spaces. And I'm going to choose bread for that. 100 tons should be enough. And of course I need to check on my production here in New Catan then. That I produce enough bread. So there's definitely enough beer. That's not a big deal. But the bread could be a problem. How's the flower looking? Good, and we have enough green, so I suggest we build another flour mill. And then another bakery, or two more bakeries. Like that. Very nice. Okay, that's one step um, to increase it a bit. And of course we also want to have more paved streets everywhere. So my buildings can produce or carry the goods faster. We do have enough bricks for now. Let's do the same in the in the city. And I'm just glad the paved streets don't cost as much bricks anymore, as many bricks anymore as in previous games. So it's definitely easier to build paved streets now. And not so tedious anymore. Like I remember Anno 1503, you had to have a lot of that stuff. So it cost a lot. Okay, that should be good for now. We have some more dirt streets here. Very nice. There's a hospital, so the hospital should have paved streets around itself to have the maximum efficiency. Looking good now, very nice. And one more thing that I wanted in Bell Rock was the steel beam production, so I can't rely on that all the time. And bricks, of course, so I'm going to have another clipper. Lucky for us, we just built one. And this clipper is transporting from New Catan to Bell Rock. Bricks, 50 tons and 50 tons of steel beams. We have enough of that here anyway. And we don't need that much anymore in... Oops, that was the wrong one. And we don't need that much in New Catan anymore anyway. So let's just have it like that. Working out. And while we're at it, let's upgrade some more buildings here in New Catan. Why are they not able to upgrade? Seems like I can't upgrade. Oh, it's a bug again. Okay, let's upgrade. A few more workers here. Okay, and then we can also upgrade a few more workers to artisans, like that. Get a bit more money, but I, of course I need to have a close look at my consumption. And as always, she's annoying as hell. I need a, more, a few more ship of the lines, I think, so... Yeah, the next one can be done soon. 
Alrighty, so in Bellrock, looking good. The new district here. And we should get more building materials here then as well, soon. Just like that. Okay, I should have my clipper over here. Let's buy some timber. And also some bricks for now. Doesn't cost me much anyway. And let's have a look what quest he wants or has in, in store. Pick up quest for 8,000. No, I don't think we need to do that. Okay, so bread is coming in soon as well, um, and then we only need the school, and for happiness we also need a church here. Oh, he's buying the second chair in La Isla. Isla, I have to look for that. See what he's doing here. Let's buy it back. Can't afford to lose one of our islands. We're not sunk yet. Right. And La Isla is waiting for the coffee. Production. Still haven't gotten one. fried plantains here I need to focus on that as well in view castle so for that reason we need a few more of those plantain plantations because I need to produce uh, fried plantain for La Ila as well here in view castle that's the problem so I need more than just a few four should be enough I hope I have the space for that oh they need 128 no then I don't have the space here Three, perhaps, but not more. Epidemic spreads across your city. Yeah, it's okay. It's not ideal, but it's okay. So we have a few more of them. And fish oil, that's the culprit here, because I don't have much, any more beach space. So what I could do, I could increase the production of that. Yeah, it doesn't increase my unhappiness that much. So let's just have a higher production here for that. That should do it. And then we need a few more kitchens. So I need three more kitchens, I think. Like that. And I think I also need another warehouse here. Okay, so that should do it. We'll we'll wait for that and see how far it goes. Very nice. And in La Ila, yeah, I can build some more houses here. Okay, that should do it. And they also want a church here. Let's build one here. And of course, when I build so many new houses, I also need to focus on my ponchos. I think I have one already. I should have a pon- yeah, there it is. My ponchos. And we'll have to increase that. So let's also have another street here. Another warehouse. And for that, I need, I think, three more. Should be sufficient that hopefully I've got the space for that 
Ah, that's looking good. That's one. Two and three. Very nice. And three more Ponchadarnas. With that air, we need a bit more wood. Once we have it, we can just build it. You will never escape yourself. Very nice. On this beautiful island. Beautiful tropical island here. And they are unhappy. Why? Oh, okay. The marketplace doesn't go as far, so let's build another one here. That should do it then. I, still have a few. I just need, yeah, 10 tons of timber, but I have that in a second. Very nice. Let's have a second one here, and then I can have another district here for Laila. Okay, let's have a look at the fried plantains real quick. Yep, going up again, very nice. So we just need to wait on that for a few minutes now and see how it turns out. Right, I just enjoy the relaxing music in the background right now. For a change, we don't have any Russian choir. like that village here so small so tiny so yeah having a beach on either side Not too many changes i hope newspaper oh, impeccable timing as always we will all be what glad news Alrighty, that's that and in belrock we can build a few more houses let's have a look at the fish first and workload is also looking better. And back we are with a dramatic music. Such a pity you So many villages now that I have or cities and all of them look different like here's a beautiful river just beside Belrock and the city is going to be on both sides of that and we can also upgrade a few more farmers here to workers very nice just like that and we also will need a fire station over here okay let's just check how it affects the bread yeah, so bread is going down now. I think 100 tons would be a bit too much. And I do have so much beer, so one of my routes, like this one here... Yeah, let's take 50 tons of beer with us. So that just boosts our tax income quite a bit every time some beer lands in Belrock. Okay, next up would be the copper and zinc. So we have all the materials here in Bad Glencher. For that I will need another clipper though. Oh, I do have one here and one here, so that's enough. We want to have the brass smelteries then. I don't know where yet though. Do want it to have a new katan. Ah, it costs attractiveness and I don't have any more beach space here I think a bit here but that doesn't look beautiful for the glass production I 
How much glass do I have? 87 tons. No, I want to have that on another island. Balrog hasn't gotten enough space here though either, so I think Little Fresh would be a good spot. Yeah, we have speed, uh, beach space here for the glass, and then we have the brass smell trees, and we do have the workers here as well, without building a new commute up here. So... Yeah, let's have the brass smeltery here, and then I can just deliver that to New Catan, and there we have the spectacle factories then. So let's start with that. Let's start with the sink that we have here. And I think I need two warehouses for that. Like so. So that's our sink. And here we have the copper. First I need a commute up here. Lucky for us, I do have the materials. And then let's have a look. Copper, coal, coal, copper. Damn it, it's far away again each stations ship under attack ship under attack yeah, she's going to lose one of her ships now. Serves her right. Okay, and we need two warehouses here. And then we can start with the copper. One and two. Okay, so that's the copper. And now I can take one of my clippers and say Blood Glanter, Relington to Vilfresh. And here I say in Bad Glencher, you take Sink. And in Rellington you take Copper. And you deliver, deliver all of that to Bill Fresh. And this clipper here is going to do that. Why has he sunk one of my ships? Is the... Oh, it's over already again. I need to have another ceasefire here, but we are in a good relationship already. On a good way to the next uh, stage to peace. A fire consumes one of your factories. Not all my mites are so perfect. Okay, but we have now the production here, and now I just need to start my brass smelteries here in Will Fresh, and I'm also going for my well, not glass, glass I would I will do in in Yucatan I think, but the brass, and for the brass I need steel, windows, and reinforced concrete. Let's get one of our clippers. I still should have one. There it is. To New Catan, and we can do that there. And let's also produce another man of war and another, another frigate here. Just say the word.
Okay, now I've got some bread here as well. So I should be able to have some artisans. Oh, the school is missing, okay. Well, let's have a look at the school. I need it, of course, to be as central as possible. Seems like a good spot here. Like that. And of course, we also need to have brick streets here in Bell Rock. Okay, my workers are content now. Everything's ready. Yeah, a church that would be needed still. And I can build one. So let's build a church here in the center. To provide some more happiness. Okay, so next up would be artisans in Bell Rock then as well. So we don't have so many workers because that really consumes um, our taxes now. Royal tax is quite high because workers are so many, so plentiful. So I need to upgrade them and I can do that now. And we're doing that in the next episode. And where's my fleet? We should also be able to take her island up here again. Or at least, at the very least, destroy some more of her ships. That should be my goal. But it gets a bit tedious because I'm going for a peace treaty at some point with her. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so we should have copper and zinc now in Ville Fresh. And once I have the materials there, we're going to start with the brass production and the spectacles for the engineers. Stay tuned. <laughs> 